Let's uh, get another call. This is Thanks. Sherry, who's on the line from Indianapolis. Hello, Senator McCain. Hi, Sherry. Hi, how are you? Fine, thanks. I, I didn't see you Saturday night, but I <laughs> want to tell you, I would have been one of those uh, McCain Democrats. I thank you, Sherry. So I'm uh, hopefully we'll see you running again soon. Thank you. Um, my question is, um, I feel as an American first and foremost, and always voting, that I am so disheartened with this this kind of like this Christian coalition, the ultra-right wing, it feels like I'm being strangled um, to, to be religious. And I'm secular, I'm an American first and foremost, and I'm moral. But I, do you get the sense that, that that pull of so much of this religious kind of focus in, say, the example of the abortion issue, is that what is, is that what you think is driving such a divisive wedge between the Democrats and the Republicans, so much anger? I think that's part of the problem. During my campaign, I gave a, for president, I went to Virginia Beach, Virginia, and gave a speech saying that um, Mr. Falwell and Mr. Reverend Falwell and Robertson had way too much influence uh, over our party. But I believe there's an extreme left that has uh, an ordinate influence over the Democratic Party a as well. Um, recently, uh, Reverend, it was a Falwell, Falwell or Robertson, I get them mixed up. One of them called Mohammed uh, a terrorist. Oh, I think that I was that was Falwell. I believe. Uh, Falwell. You, you know th that that to me is inconceivable. But it's also inconceivable for me for Harry Belafonte uh, to insult uh, Colin Powell and call him uh, was it a house slave or or, right, or, right. or or something like that. You see, I think I think we've got problems with both extreme right and extreme left in this country. And what happens is when voter apathy and people are turned off off by the process and by the negative ads and they drop out, then the extremes take over the political machinery and that's when we're, we're in trouble in America. You see my point, Sherry? Right. 